So, so that's what you use for like vlogging. Okay, hold on, that's not gonna stay up. But yeah, I tried to be cheap and get the oh, but get it the um this one from Amazon versus the Sony, the real Sony handle. But it doesn't. Where's this um? I just want you to focus, pull me in, pull me closer Give me that diagnosis, don't my mind like it's oceans Just one touch leaves me helpless, on repeat like it's endless That she's turned to a white dress, looks so good, damn you did this, yeah I just want you to focus on my love, just focus on my I just want you to focus on my love, just focus on my I just want you to focus on my love, just focus on my just focus on my Like you tryna earn that diploma Do it over and over, yeah Make it pop Coca-Cola Keep it hot Barcelona But she's turned to a white dress Let's soak up when I make it, yeah I just want you to focus on my love Just focus on my I just want you to focus on my love Just focus on my I just want you to focus on my love Just focus on my try to see how much I can like vlog of this since I'm new to this and just try to do the best with it so just go shoot us Yeah. 
salarico, como te explico, no me complico, a mí me gusta pasarla rico. Después de las 12 salimos a buscar el party, ando con los tíos, estamos en modo safari, con un fue violento que parece musical, y yo tomando vino y algunos fumando mal. La policía está molesta porque ya se puso buena la fiesta, pero estamos legal, no me pueden arrestar, por eso yo sigo hasta que amanezca en ti. Yo no me complico, como te explico, que a mí me gusta pasar a rico, como te explico, yo no me complico, a mí me gusta pasar a rico. <laughs> But also, oh, that's what I did. I didn't bring it to show you what mine does. But that's your camera. Okay, so that's your camera. I like that. Well, no, that's the one that I wanted. I wanted to get. So my, I just recently got um, my uh, for the weekend of, that we did St. Patty's Day. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's not recording that. I thought it was. I think I want to eat or I don't want to eat Have you ever hit an octopus? Oh, you don't eat duck? Yeah. It's fine. Scoby duck? No, I eat them. I love those ducks. They taste like chicken. Yeah, this is a whole different life for me. Ryan and her a lot of people from, from, from in that place. Probably from the office. But I've never gone to visit that because I don't want to be there. Look, she, they, they have a name for this guy. You're talking about him? I'm like, yeah. What condo are you talking about? It's not a condo, it's a house. That blue house? My, my friend bought that house. You're talking about the, the, the right so across. The first house. You know how it's the empty lot, the parking yeah, lot? That blue that house. That first house. Because Africans own that. No, not they they did, they sold. no, they sold it. She sold it to my friend from White. Oh, she, did she get a good deal? Because they they bought that. They bought that really cheap and flipped that. Yeah, that's probably what they did. I don't know. Somebody no. Yes, I'm about to talk about you. She's sitting over here looking at me. My baby Graceland is officially seven months old today, and she is giving this mama a run for my money. Yeah, this girl is like going, going, going. That's to be expected um, all day, but oh, she is wearing me out. Okay, so. Um, I did just want to get into um, some things that I did pick up, um, kind of like spread out over the past couple of weeks and things like that. Um, but first, I'm going to start off with some things that I did get from like Sephora, from the Sephora sale. So I'm really just trying to get like my skin in order. Not that it's terrible or anything like that i just want to use some products that's really going to like hydrate my face um and things like that because my face is it's dry right now um i was well i am still using the youth to the people it's a kale face wash i was using that when i was pregnant with graceland along with this fresh um strawberry scrub i'm about to show you i was using that um 
but I just need something that's gonna like oof, put some moisture back into my face. So my face is really dry and it just feels like mm, icky. Um, so I picked up the Superberry Hydrate Glow Dream Oil. It's like a it's a, a oil and it's maki plus Aussie prickly pear and goji. I think that's how you pronounce it. So this is a fast absorbing facial oil instantly hydrates leaving skin velvety soft with a healthy glow, healthy looking glow. Squalene Jehovah. I may mispronounce that. Sunflower oil and our propriety proprietary antioxidant rich superberry blend illuminate and revive dehydrated skin i definitely need like some type of reviving to my skin so i'm interested in seeing how this works on my skin along with uh, uh, a moisturizer if you use this please let me know your thoughts um, speaking of like hydrating some moisture, I purchased the Laneige Moisture Cream. Um, the representative um, at Sephora recommended this. This is the Laneige uh, Water Bank Moisture Cream. When I put this on my hand in store, it just felt so light and moisturizing. It didn't feel heavy at all on my hand and I'm like really excited to use this because I do use Elf's um, hydrating cream. It does feel a little heavy um, and I just need something that's not going to clog my pores like in this area. For some reason for the past couple of years this area of mine gets super clogged my, like my pores are horrible right here they just clog up even when i do like a steam and do my extractions it's like the next day it's clogged up again so if you guys have any tips on how to make sure any regimens anything like that please leave it down below because I'm just trying to get this together and do some dark spot correcting kind of like not the harsh way using retinol or anything like that because I'm nursing but some type of natural way please let me know so um oh you know what this just says it's a rich moisture cream a unique blend of green mineral water Provide soothing hydration by forming a protective moisture barrier. So that's going to be good to, to pair. This is what the girl at Sephora said that she um, used as well. Um, I also picked up this spray. I used, you know what, I used to use the green one. That worked good on my face, but their rose water one? No, no. So this um, is a facial spray with aloe, chamomile, and lavender. So I would probably use that as well on <clears throat> my face after I kind of get that regimen. I got to figure out what step I'm going to use that on for. But this is the strawberry scrub I was mentioning by Fresh. So this is a sugar strawberry exfoliating face wash I'm a fan of a scrub and I'm a fan of a harsh scrub like I'm one of those that will ooh, get in there because I feel as though that it's working <laughs> once I like really scrub my face so I like to do a face I like to do a scrub first after I wipe off my face scrub and then do a wash but I've been learning that harsh scrubs are not good because it can tear your face and things like that, tear your pores. So this is a nice light um, face scrub. So this 
so um, basically it's just apply to damp skin and massage with warm water until sugar dissolves then rinse customize your cleanse by using more water for a gentler cleaning experience so I do like this it gently refines and softens so this should be well I already know how it is I'm not gonna say this should be good as well because I've been using it but this is gonna be good um what else did I pick up oh I picked up the fresh this is new the fresh um umbrian clay purifying mask deeply cleanse and purifies is it umbrian I don't know that may be how you pronounce it so I'm interested in using this as well um I just need a mask for when I do for my skincare regimen um I just do need a mask you just want me to pick you up don't you what time is it? It's like snack time for her. Okay, give me a second. Let me. I'm about to give her a snack really quick. Okay. So I just showed you guys the fresh. Um, what's going on my camera? I just showed you guys the fresh. Um, what else did I pick up? I picked up the Fenty um, Pro Filter Soft Matte Longwear. My shade is in 410. Um, I was really salty that they got rid of the other the other foundation. I have it upstairs, but they got they discontinued this other foundation. And I'm like, dang, that was my that was my good one. I love I love that foundation. Um because it gave off a dewy look. And I use the Fenty, the soft, soft, is it soft like primer? I ha I use that one and I really like that one because it doesn't feel the primer doesn't feel heavy on my face or anything like that. But they used to have my makeup like <laughs> oh the was so complete, but I I like that one. I also um so Macy's also had um a beauty sale and I went to MAC because I wanted like a finishing powder and I typically use the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish um, in dark. Is it dark or dark deep? Whatever. I went to Macy's. They didn't have it. So I'm like, okay. I walked down to MAC, the MAC store, uh, the store itself. They didn't have it either. So I'm just like, okay, well, I just really need a setting powder. So when I was at um, Sephora... I picked up the um, Huda Beauty, Huda Beauty, um, Easy Bake Loose Powder and Cinnamon Bun. <sighs> when I tried this on in the store, I was like, oh, okay, I like it. But now that the finishing powder is back in stock at Mac, I think I'm gonna take this back and get what I, I I'm gonna do what I what I'm used to. So. If you guys use this and you like this, do you use it for like setting underneath the eye or do you use it as a finishing powder? Let me know because I'm debating on if I should keep this or not. Um, I did want to show you guys, um, and I apologize about my lighting. It's just like, oh my goodness, going in and out. Um... A couple of items that I did pick up from Zara. I really got these cute flats with the embellished wraps. They are so cute. I wanted to take these back, but I'm just like, let me keep these because these can be like dressed up a little bit um, or dressed down. It gives like a perfect kind of mix that I can do because of these um, stones so these were really cute I have these in a 38 guys like my feet I swear my feet grew 
when I had my baby. Like, my feet were already swollen, but I am not the size I was before. Weight-wise, I already know I'm not, but foot-wise. I also uh, picked up this ruffle bodysuit from Zara. This is how it looks. I am a sucker for ruffles, like anything exaggerated, I love it, like an exaggerated sleeve. I got this in a medium, so I, I didn't even try it on, so I don't even know how it fits, but that shirt was really cute. I also had seen this on somebody on Instagram, the set. So I ran to the store and I picked this up along with the pants. The top, I have it in a large. The pants, I also picked it up in a large and I should have known better um, that I was not gonna fit the large. This is like, sorry. I should have known that I was not gonna be able to fit the large in pants. So, um, I took those back. Um, I was debating on taking this back as well. I don't know why I buy stuff and then when I sit and look at it, I'm like, eh, am I really going to wear it? But it's too late for me to take either of these items back. So, I'm going to keep them. Um, I'm just going to order the pants and a, a 2XL. And hopefully that fits. The large, I'm, I was able to pull it up, but it was just tight in the butt area. And I just knew if I wore those pants somewhere and sat down that it was going to split in my butt. I, I just knew it. So I just did not, um, I just, yeah, definitely have to take those pants back. I also went to TJ Maxx and I picked up this really cute ring. So I'm a first time mom and I seen this mama ring let me turn it this way okay here it is this mama ring it was so cute so i'm excited to wear that let me turn it the other way this looks so cute so so those are uh, some things that um, I did pick up. Um, also went out to eat a couple of days ago as well. And me and my girlfriend, my friend, we were talking about like pertaining to people. I know this was like a topic also on social media as well. When you go out to like a group dinner do you expect somebody else to pay do you like split up divide up the bill and whatever group it is so if it's like a group of four and the bill is like five hundred dollars do you split split it up individually or you just pay for your meal or what do you do because we were talking about that and when me and like my friends go out it's like we kind of go back and forth. I may pay the bill one time. They may pay the bill one time. You know, we kind of go back and forth. Um, or, you know, if I, when I was out and about, um, you know, I buy my friends a round of drinks or they may buy the meal if we stop somewhere and get something to eat. But when it's a larger group, are you expecting, like, when the bill comes, are you sitting there looking like, Like, you're not expecting the bill to come. Or do you expect somebody to, like, just grab the tab and be like, oh, yeah, you know what? I got it. Um, because I'm just interested in knowing people's thoughts because of a something. Just want to know your thoughts about that. But, uh, whew, this mama is, like, tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm sorry. Yes, Grace, I'm tired. I have to 
make her lunch. I puree her food, so I have to make her um, bananas. She's gonna have bananas today and she's getting frustrated or she wants another snack. So I'm gonna get two of them back and I'll be back to talk some more. What's up everybody? Whew, today is, what's today? Wednesday and I was, my day was starting off a little rough, but I'm trying to get it together. I'm trying to get it together. That postpartum is no joke. I'm gonna just say that it's, um, so I was able to, well, Grayson is at my sister's um, for a little bit. And this is the first time she's been, we've been without each other. Well, you know what? You know, my mom and stuff stopped by to watch her. Um, but this is the first time she's been actually out of the house at some place else. So I am missing her dearly. Um, but I need it a wusa moment um and i definitely excuse me <laughs> need to pump as well because i'm definitely filling up right now my chest is ooh, mommy needs to pump um but i was able to um stop at ulta i needed to get uh, my eyebrow pencil um so i just wanted to show you guys i typically get the nyx um eyebrow pencil and espresso it's do i have this okay let me turn this around this is how so i have that um i use that on my eyebrows i love it i've been using it for years it's perfect for getting like this super sharp look that you want it's easy to use um, for one. And then I just go in with uh, my concealer and my brushes to kind of give it that shape I want. I was also, as I previously mentioned, on the hunt for the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Dark. It's been out of stock on the site. Don't know why, but it's been out of stock. So at Ulta, they now sell Mac in the store, which I haven't been to Ulta in obviously a minute because I didn't know. Um, so I was excited. I'm like, oh, I don't have to go to the mall. So let me just pick up. I thought it was, I'm in dark. I use dark. But for some reason, I was thinking of dark deep. So I ended up getting dark deep. Um, but I used it. On, I don't know why I put it back in the package. But I did use it. Uh-oh. But it was actually okay. It was actually okay on my face. I use it as like a finishing powder. Um, and I was satisfied with the look it was, you know, giving me or it gave me. I don't know if you guys can see that. But um, I picked that up. <clears throat> oh, I forgot about this. I also picked up some butter gloss in perline no no i didn't this is in butterscotch hmm i was looking at perline but i don't know why i didn't get it so i got butterscotch this is a pretty color let's see how that looks i put um the laneige lip mask on my lips and it gives me this beautiful um juicy lip look so oh here it is i want to show you guys this right here this is that stuff for your lips if you're anybody like me um that bites their lips i bite my lips because my nerves are shot um 
I also bite on my nails if they're not done or I get so nervous that I like start biting at my nails. Um, but this helps moisturize and like get your lips snapping them back in place. Um, I also picked up the Juvia's Place um, blush. Is it Rogi? Rougi? But I picked this up and somebody's walking by but um I picked this up and I thought the colors were so pretty to give like that blush coral look so I'm kind of excited to use I did use this one and this is I used it on my cheeks. Not sure if you could see a little bit of it, but it was it was cute. It was really cute, y'all. And here's the pink one. That's really cute. <clears throat> Let me close my window. Give me a second. Okay, here I come. I just had to close my window because I don't want people walking by, looking all in my house because I got this ring light back here to give me some light because it's a gloomy day out and I'm not getting natural sunlight right now. So I wanted to show you guys that. Um, what else? Oh, <clears throat> this is what I'm loving on my face right now. The Black Opal Stick Foundation. I used to use this back in my early 20s. I'm in the shade Nutmeg. When I tell you this, this is still that girl. This is still, it gives you that full foundation look for half the price. Um, and I went back to that. And I've been loving it because I, it gives me that skin like finish that I've been looking for nowadays instead of the caked up, nothing is wrong with the cake up, but it, it just gives me a skin look. It's giving me that, that I'm loving and that I miss. I also went to Target and I picked up these cute PJs. This is so cute. I picked this up. And uh, this is from Stars Above. And I got, it was what? I got this in a large and it was like $21.99. I need some new PJs bad. Um, this large looks kind of large maybe I need to could have went for a medium but oh well and I also picked up Graceland some teething there teething relief Graceland is teething and baby is crying and chewing on everything and I feel so bad for her like I got all these teething toys and she still wants to kind of like nibble on my hand and just giving her the boob is it heals her for a moment. It soothes her. But I really want her to have some type of relief. So <clears throat> I'm interested in seeing how this works. It's a natural a natural way. It doesn't have any artificial sweeteners, any preservatives, anything like that. Um, I think the main active ingredient is chamomile, which is really good. So, and it has plant-based actives in here so if you guys know any home remedies on to soothe my baby that's teething let me know i'm interested in trying out some natural remedies um on how to kind of soothe her and help her out also i wanted to show you guys i don't know why i threw this all in a box like this but I wanted to show you guys <clears throat> some shoes that are like, I am 
so excited to wear. Don't know where I will wear them. This is actually a 30. Oh, hold on. Did I order this right? A 39? I could have sworn I ordered a 38. So I ordered these shoes in a 38. Okay, these are from Zara. First of all, let me tell you a story. I seen these online and I was I looked at them. I was like, oh, these are so cute. But I'm like, I'm not going anywhere. So mm, what's the point? But then my friend sent me a message and say, why when I seen these, I thought of you? And I'm like, yeah, I was thinking about buying these other pairs that I'm about to show you. I was thinking about buying those. But I'm just like, mm, I just may get the other ones. Okay. So I went back on Zara's site and they were sold out. So I'm just like, okay, well, let me just put my name, put my email down and just do the notifications once they do get back in stock, right? Okay. And I also seen them on a reel on Instagram and that was my sign right there to cop these bad boys because when I seen that reel, these babies were hitting. Like it gives that square, that sharp square toe and they are comfortable. It's giving me like Super Mario Brothers, like spring let me give you something like comfortable to wear i also picked up these babies these are so these two sandals are so cute y'all so i got these in a 38 but they sent me a 39 in both and they were they fit which is okay so it's a us8 i was tripping okay so it's a us8 but it's a 39 okay i thought i was tripping so yeah i got these in a size eight and they fit so well this looks like it's about a four inch heel but it didn't feel like it yeah zara like these I got some pink sandals from Express, but to go with this pink blazer I had, but those sandals are going back because it just feels like I make one step and they're going to snap. Um, so I'm excited to have those. I also picked up some other, wait, let me show you guys. I also picked up this shirt, this t-shirt. I just thought this was like a real cute funky t-shirt to wear with the heels this isn't a large sometimes Zara I don't know sometimes there's stuff it may be a run small and then the next thing you know it's just like it's big so this is a large I'm just gonna I'm not sending it back I'm just gonna figure out a way to style it so I also ordered that shirt as well Wear it with some jeans or some leggings and a funky bag whenever I do go somewhere. Um, I will be ready. I also picked up these cute shoes from Nordstrom Rack. These are just some knotted heels with a little cute little baby heel in the back. I think these will really be cute with like some jeans, like a casual look or a nice spring dress. I think these will be cute and comfortable um to wear so right now i am about to fry some catfish pump and then go pick up my baby um because i miss her and i know she misses me but i am tired and but i need to get her back so i can see her dinner and spend some time with her it's just the anxiety the anxiety is real y'all like it is really real and i'm mad that this camera keep on going in and out with me i guess that's me moving too but 
moms how do you do your self-care or how do you take time to get yourself back to yourself or do you ever get back to yourself i'm just i don't know it's i don't know <laughs> i need some advice leave it below any advice that you can give because I'm nursing and although I do pump, it's just that attachment that I do have to Graceland. I just, it's so strong. Plus, since I'm a first time mom, I'm just in pandemic is over, having a baby in a pandemic and just trying to ju adjust to normal life. <sighs> yeah, I need some, I need some advice, some mommy tips to make my life a little easier. You guys, um, just let me know. Java all white, right? Couldn't hit it if niggas had I. Lanes can't call and you lie. You had it and you lost all the time. I can buy a belly, don't talk to me. For a show, 150, don't talk to me. You ain't never help your mans, don't talk to me. Proper, no propaganda. Chop a can of go yard, batting down. Big sack, a lot of hoes like Santa. Through a birthday party in a phantom. Big sack, like a dinosaur did it. And you know, did it shine like a grillet. Yeah, I sold dope and had corn roll. I can see you nigga hang with the door closed. Now I'm looking for a glove with a sparkle on it. And my CBD got chocolate on it. Big bang, take small. Make a count on some tall. Attitude on some f you do. Bang roll on what it do. Meet me at the roulette vibe. And if I ain't did it yet, I'll try. Big bang, take no bite. Bye. Big bang, take no bite. Bye. Type of money you gon' do, sight. Type of money you gon' do, bite. From the hood, type of money make you sell, bite. Type of money she gon' let you put it in the fire. Big bang, take no bite. Bye. Big bang, take little bite. She said, What you gon' do if I leave? I said, I'ma do me. B.I.G., everything zoomed in. Big bag on me, looking like I'm moving in. Got my foot in the door, and we still here. I'm a first generation millionaire. I broke the curse of my family not having it. I'm passionate, like girls that's after more than just. It is okay, Graceland. We are about to go home. I had to wipe off my glasses. <sighs> that was not smart. Okay. All right, so. Just picked up Graceland and it is raining out here, y'all. So I think it's supposed to be like a thunderstorm. So I just gotta get baby girl in the house and feed her dinner. 
I don't know what I'm gonna have for dinner. Drive a all white rank. Couldn't hit it if you niggas had iron. Lanes can't call and you lame. You had it and you lost all the time. I can buy a belly, don't talk to me. For a show, 150.